coming to the home show this weekend and our show today, HGTV's Inspector Joe. Good morning, Joe. Morning, good morning. Thank you for having me. Well, let's talk about your show on HGTV. Uh, the show is awesome. No, that's number one, right? Yeah. Uh, the show covers everything within a home. So the best part about it is that this market now is so wild with home with people buying houses. You know, ever since COVID, everyone's like running all over the place to get away from the big cities. So what this show is presenting is like a home inspection. So I'm out there teaching you what to look for while you are buying a house and spending the most money you're probably ever going to spend on something. And then the best part on top of that is Noel comes in, my uh, interior designer, we take the house apart and then we just put it back together again and in her design, which is absolutely gorgeous. So you're getting a, an array of... Uh, of like what it is to, to look for a house, buy a house, renovate a house, and then do your design. Well, Joe, as an inspector, what are some of the mistakes we make as potential home buyers? Right now, uh, people are waiting home inspections. That's the biggest mistake wow. people are making right now. Yeah. And I'm seeing it day in and day out. I'm getting calls. Hey, Joe, we, uh, we bought a house. There's a lot of problems with it. I'm like, well, did you have it inspected? They're like, no, we had to waive it. I'm like, oh, yeah. Geez, that's not good. Uh, so waiving a home inspection uh, is the number one thing I'm seeing now that's really bad. And educating yourself. Educate yourself before you buy the house. You know, there's many things you can ask, especially you're going to ask if there's ever a buried oil tank in the property. That costs lots of money. You know, ask how the roofing system is. These are all big ticket items before you even get involved. Well, do you think it's because people get excited about and maybe even anxious about buying a new home and they just don't get do the, the spade work that needs to be done? Right, exactly. So what happens a lot with me, I see, I get out in the field, I meet the clients, you know, I go in the house, everyone walks in, oh my God, this house is gorgeous, this is this, this is that, and then unfortunately sometimes Joey Buzzkill comes in and I have to, <laughs> like, take a seat back. I know you love the house, I love the house too, but... You know, your roof is caving in or, you know, you have a, a ton of asbestos in the basement. So my main goal is to educate the buyers, not scare them, but educate them on what they're getting into, but also to keep the focus on the home inspection while they're there. Don't just wander off, you know. Yeah, just stay, stay dialed in. Well, I know we're all excited to have you come to Evansville this weekend for the, the home show. When, when can we see you, Joe? Yeah, so this is the 74th. This is great. I'm, I'm so excited that I'm going to be down there. Uh, Sunday, I will be there at 1.30. I'll be on stage at 1.30. I'll be talking for about a 45, half hour, 45 minutes or so. And then there's going to be a Q&A afterwards. So, you know, bring your questions. Bring them all on. It doesn't matter what it is. When I know what I did growing up, I was swinging from trees to <laughs> home inspection, construction, my motorcycle, whatever it is. Ask me. I'm, I'm, I'm game for it all. Well, thank you so much for your time this morning, and thanks for coming into Evansville to bring your expertise. I can't wait. Thank you so much for having me. You're so welcome anytime. We'll be back with more.